In Lafouche Parish, a man is on trial for an alleged drunk driving crash that killed three Nickel State students back in 2021. All of the victims graduates of Hornville High School. WDSU reporter Morgan Lentis was in the courtroom today and talked with friends of those victims. This is going to be an emotional case. That was the warning from defense attorneys to potential jurors. And before jury selection was even done, several people were in tears in the courtroom. Joey Claymont is charged with three counts of vehicular homicide, one for each young woman who died in November of 2021 on LA-20 in Chack Bay. Lily Dufresne, Haley Koss, and Michaela Bowling were out celebrating a birthday that night when prosecutors allege Claymont hit them while driving drunk. Opening statements began this afternoon as family and friends watched on, still in pain almost two years later. I feel like he should be prosecuted to the full extent. Nothing about it. He took those three girls' lives on Lily's birthday. They were enjoying a birthday dinner. They were coming home, and Lily didn't really get to even celebrate her birthday. And this trial is happening about two miles away from Nichols State University, where the three victims had just started their college careers. I talked to a legal analyst who says even if the defense team had asked for a change of venue, those are rarely granted in Louisiana. In Thibodeau, I'm Morgan Lentis, WDSU News. Morgan, thank you. If convicted and given the maximum punish for vehicular homicide, Claymont could be sentenced to up to 90 years in prison.